what's up everybody happy to be back you know with another episode just wanted to give you guys a quick update see the progress of the e30 uh, remember from the last episode uh the car was going in to my buddy's robin shop to get you know painted and originally we was going to keep well i was going to stay with the same color the like a silver but i was going to do like a different silver i don't know if i have i think i mentioned that but it seems like um change of plans so I'm gonna show you why there's uh, some change of plans <laughs> Robin convinced me to change the color of the car and he started literally just uh it literally started stripping the whole car down so we're gonna do a color change I'm debating on what color to choose now um, I don't know people are telling me to go with a bright color I'm not really a bright color kind of guy the brightest color that I usually go with is like a white and I really don't want to do white on this car so I'm thinking, um, I'm thinking of a nice black, like a, a dark, like, I don't know, something about black in these in, in E30s are like really, really, really sick to me. So, I think, I think a nice, like, even like the Diamond Schwartz, like a French Diamond Schwartz is like a real sick color to go with. So, I think that might be the color I'm leaning towards, unless something else pops up. Um, you know, I mean, there's other colors out there that look good on E30s like red. I'm not really a red kind of guy, um, but red looks good. Uh, you know, there's certain blues like Atlantis blue looks good on a, you know, I've seen those like on the E92 and three and um, even the F80, um, you know, kind of was thinking about doing purple again, kind of like how I did with the M6. But I think black would look sick. I think I could really make black look sick. I mean, granted, the Porsche's already black, so, you know, it's whatever, so. But I mean, to have two black cars in the fleet, it doesn't matter. They both look sick, two vintage black cars, whatever. Man, it's crazy to see the car like this and how completely different it's gonna look in the movie. They already started sanding down the hood and, you know, little imperfections, like little dents and stuff, the trunk too. So we're gonna see where that goes. I'm excited. I'm excited to see how this turns out. Real excited. Um, remember, as I mentioned before, I was gonna take the door handles, I mean the door moldings off and shave it. And I don't know, I think I might actually keep the moldings now. I kind of like the moldings look, you know? So, like, for instance, like, this is the door right here, so. I think I might leave that. I think I might actually leave these moldings. Just like respray them, make them look fresh. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna replace the, the windshields, the rear and the front one. I'm gonna try to get the windows replaced as well. You know, try to really make this car look real, real new and neat. So, I'm excited, guys. I know you guys are waiting for the Porsche, so, you know, I, I feel kind of bad that, you know, the Porsche is moving at the pace it is, but this stuff takes time. You guys know this stuff takes time. But, you know, the Porsche is still in progress. Like, you know, the kit is on the way, which is great. Um, we still just have no idea when the car is coming out yet because of the travel restrictions in Japan. But there's still some progress on the Porsche. Parts are still coming in on the Porsche. Um, gonna, like I said, I'm gonna be doing episodes on those two. But in the meantime, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna film whatever I could film that's, you know, that's making some progress, and the E30 is making some progress right now. So, as soon as this is done, then I'm gonna put on the bags, put on the other little, you know, little items that I have for the E30. It's gonna look real good. It's gonna look real good. But I think it'll be cool to have a real clean black E30 with a real clean black uh, 993 Porsche RWB. And I think it'd be badass. Let me know what you guys think. Um, pretty short episode. Just wanted to give you guys a quick update. And I guess tune in next time. I'm going to show you guys some more progress. Show you how it goes. Um, shouldn't be long. The car shouldn't take long to be done. So, uh, soon. I mean, I would like to start bringing the car to some shows. I'm still on the fence about wheels. So, let me know what to do with that. Like I said, I got some diamond racing stilly. Just something just to, just to, have, just to sit on something decent. But... I'm really thinking I'm gonna do some three piece and I'm, I'm debating, but I, I don't know. It's like, I, I, wanna, I wanna stick to the budget, but oh, man, it's so tempting, this car stuff, you know how I got it. It's like a, it's, 
It's literally like a, a, a black hole. Once you once you fall in it, it's like you don't come back out. It just keeps, you know. So very expensive hobby, you guys know. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe, guys. Hit me up on Instagram. Hit me up YouTube, whatever. And um, thanks for watching.